Hello, everyone, and welcome to this Simuls on Sunday. So I'm French Grandmaster Laurent Fossiné, and I will play a Simul against nine players from all over the world. So welcome for that. Of course, I will I will commentate during my games, and um, let's see how it, uh, how it goes. I mean, I have 30 minutes. I mean, everyone has 30 minutes plus 30 seconds uh, increment per move. So... Um, That's the same time for everyone, and uh, I have a bit of a handicap, but uh, that's uh, how it has to be when you are a master. So we should we should start. Are, are we ready, Ayelan? We can start, yeah? Okay. Uh, so I'm waiting. Nikki Mullins is the first game I saw. So Nikki, good luck. And I will start with C5 here. I will go... Okay. Some moves are played, but I shouldn't do that. So I will go against my friend Mbappé. Of course, this is uh, the soccer player. I will go D4, E4, E4 against Mbappé. Then I have Donald the Duck. Hi, Donald the Duck. So I have no idea about the, the level of my opponents, which is a bit confusing when I make uh, side moves in French. I have generally an idea of... Uh, level of my opponent. So Sam SG from Poland, I guess. Good luck. Then we have Zugzang 74. I guess this is a German uh, German player. So I will go knight f3. Sometimes I'm, I'm black. Some people are more clever than others and gets white. Hi, Rocco. Ah, French guy. Okay. Nice to see you here. E4. I will go E5. And against Filuzov, then I will play faster, but I want the first move I want to, to enjoy and say hi to everyone. So from Czech Republic. And another one, Gregor Samsa from Czech Republic as well. Hi, E4, E5. And then with the next one, the next and I think very last one, is you must lose to this box, which is, of course, a reference to uh, Maxi Box with uh, pseudo, the nickname of uh, the world champion, Magnus Carlsen on Chess24. And I think that's... A, I didn't forget a game, I think. Can you confirm, maybe, uh, Ayelen, if you're still here? I cannot play a move here. Okay. It's okay, huh? But I cannot play. Ah, I can play on this side. Okay, knight f3, knight c6. So you see on the small boards on my left, I'm playing uh, here. And when if I have some problems, then I will I will open up the the window and play and start to think a bit more. But here I should basically just play fast. So c5. Let's go e3. Oh, I cannot play here. Which is a bit. Sometimes it happens. I don't know why. I played e3. Okay, so it came. And now, okay, d4, I just take. And, okay, I have to go back. I don't know, maybe I have too many. Um, I don't know, it's okay. So here I can take as well. So this is g6. Let's go knight bd2 against g6 to play e4, knight f3, knight c6. Okay, here we have, okay, and I have this game. So you see. Already, people are thinking here. Here, this is a line I like. Queen f6, my small line for rapid and blitz. Okay, this is how it is. So I just go bishop g2. Okay, I will uh, as well play this small line in uh, in the scotch, which is kind of funny. I mean, if you go, it was shown to me by uh, Richard Rapport, young prodigy from um, from Hungary, and. Yeah, it's a, it's a funny line. So here Mbappe is playing Zo Solimo. Let me off. It's a laggy day today. I don't know why. Okay. Um, that's not good. Irene, are you still there? No, I, I 
no it's not my connection because everything is fine i think the show is fine but yeah there is a small bug in uh the new play zone which will be out quite soon i guess but you see uh, we have some still we don't want to to present uh, you the play zone till it's not completely perfect so we are testing it playing some simul on it but from time to time there's some small issues like now um yeah okay but i shouldn't open slack uh while i'm sharing my screen <laughs> uh, otherwise a a everyone will know our secret so this is not this is not Yeah, do that. I mean, like, up to you. Okay, here we go. We are back. Small, small, very small issue. And see, I'm doing a um, safest route to, to. Oh, maybe I will. I will try the. I just had to refresh. So ninety seven bishop d two is a line. I was playing. I, I will just try again. The if it doesn't work, then because that's the nicest, of course, view. So. Bishop c5, c3. Okay, that's very normal. Knight e7, we go. I should be very careful, of course, with the time, not to get too long time. Here, I played bishop before check to prevent some knight c3 in the future. Uh, so here, d4, this is a very solid line. Uh, d5, so now can I take just a pawn? I will play bishop d5, which is kind of Ragozin tempo up. Kind of funny, I goes in 96 here. Okay, so d6 here. So here in general, we go bishop b5 check to prevent 96. Opa. And here, bishop b2 he seems to know what he's doing. I have friend Rocco. Um, castle, we can go b3. This is double fianchetto. Bishop c4 is a small line. Oh, actually, it's a main line. So I like this castle, castle b6 here, which I used to play. Oh, d6 is normally not advised. Yeah, it's too early. You should go with your bishop out, but okay, it's not such, uh, it's not a losing, losing move. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight games. One is missing. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh huh. I, I don't have a bigger screen. Ah. But where? Well. Okay, so I will I will keep on doing that because otherwise. So here is e five. Bishop g four shouldn't be too good. I just take here. Um. Here b3, okay, bishop c6, I go bishop d3, and let's go here. Okay, knight d4, so I go bishop c5, and the ninth game is this, queen is really g6, sorry. 
Okay, so all good. Ah, E6 was played quickly, so I just go castle. Yeah, bishop c5 is more sad than bishop b4 is somehow too doorish, so I don't want to do that. Okay, I can come back to the previous one. So e5, d5 played by Mbappe, but this is supposed to be just good for white uh, because you will have this, this pawn on c5, which will be always weak. Uh, and I take c5, so now I cannot take. I take bishop d1, bishop f7, king f7, bishop g5, and f6. So I should go bishop e2. Okay, now he's thinking, okay, c5 is the right move. Castle here for Morocco. We spring very fast off on Morocco. Castle, castle. Bishop e3, I go bishop b6, played a few games here. Knight f6, so I can play in the style of Ragozin with c4, and here g6 is thinking. Always a good news when my opponents are thinking. So knight e3 here, bishop e2. Okay, so it's my opponent to move. Yeah, bishop g4, which gives a, a free bishop here. Okay, if I get the two bishops, and I'm, I'm, I think I'm doing well in such. Okay, knight bd7, e5 becomes tempting to go e5, e6, but I have time to I have the center, two bishops, y2, to, to do something crazy, or just hook one. And see, so Oko now is thinking Donald Duck as well. I don't see any castle, it's a very, very normal move. Yeah, bishop e2, queen c7 by Mbappe. Okay, obviously he wants to, to attack my pawn e5, but that's not going to, to hop, I guess. And here, so bishop b6, c4, bishop d6. Okay, then I will get some isolated pawn. I guess I will play against his isolated pawn. Okay, bishop e2 is a very normal move, but bishop g7, knight f6. It's a pretty standard mauxi, but black is supposed to be to be fine here. Aha, queen d2. So this is my game, I think, against. Anna Muzichuk, which I lost, but uh, the opening was not to blame, actually. And if he takes on c6, I play dc6, and it's a funny kind of Berlin, but kind of acceptable, I guess, for, for black. It's what I thought, at least, back in, in the days. Uh, so he played knight g6, and now, generally, you go h4 in search. Okay, H4 cannot really harm. Yeah, thinking for some time already. Okay, castle from Donald Duck, and I'm going B6. If knight takes C6, I just take with the queen, so I will remove that. Here, it's black to play. Okay, B4. So Rocco, uh, of course, if bishop B4, C B4, queen A1, but after bishop B4, I think he wants bishop G5. Some nice intermezzo, and I have to remove the queen, and you can just take my bishop. So this is not a good news, so I have to go bishop b6. And here, e5, c3, I just keep the tension in the center. I have two bishop, as I, as I said previously. Simon and Joe. So I'm not sure I will have time with the chat, but you are, you are of course, very, very welcome to, to chat. Let me see. I will put English, because it's... It's French rapport is great. Yeah, that's true. We need Tekian, but Tekian cannot always be here. So Rocco is into some kind of prep. Bishop g5 is playing very fast again. And if I play queen g6 by b5, knight e5, then he can take on e7. But I can go king e7. I'm not that afraid of, about this. Okay, let's go for that. That could go wrong for me. But okay, let's see. Gregor Samsa was in the chat, wishing all good games. You are a team against me. Which is, uh, sometimes you can just uh, shopping at the same time together. That's kind of uh, very bad news for me. So F6 is a good move for Mbappe. So what should I do here? Can I go, maybe I have to take, I guess he's taking back. 
And he has a good center, but his king is still a bit vulnerable. But yeah, that's not easy here. Maybe I should go long castle anyway. I will go h5 then. Okay, queen is seven. Why not? Can I just take here? If he takes only two, I just take back. And here, knight c6, which is normal again. I will go bishop a3 and take back if I can pre move. Okay, bishop h4, play the tempo, but I'll find Roko. Okay, it's not kidding, Roko here. Um, that's interesting. Let's develop a bit. Just bishop g4, I'm not sure this is a good move. If he plays again at tempo, I suspect him to to bluff a bit. If he start to think here, that would make uh, that would make a lot of sense. So knight c6. Now what did I say? I can go bishop p3 or not? I can. I will just take takes here. Queen king d8. Here takes takes. And let me ask some question. I will go queen c2. So knight c3 here is very normal. 23 minutes. See, I not that I forgot about that game, but uh, yeah, I should be careful with the time already. So let's go to the first uh, uh, here. So Mbappe is thinking bishop d6. So I just go g3 to prevent some knight f4 and go h5. Yeah, queen e5. I'm just going knight c3. Okay, here e5. Okay, then I will go just rook e1. I will again pre move this knight a3. And Roku is thinking finally b6. Played very fast by. Um, philosoph. So this is not, of course, this is not bad for black, but I'm enjoying my bishops. Why is the premove didn't work? Okay, and here I wanted queen c2 to ask some questions already. Okay, castle was played. I will do the same. And I will do that. And here. And Mbappe is thinking, which is weird for him. Uh, b6 here, so it's almost everywhere it's my opponent to play. Uh, if he takes here, we soy. I will just take back with the a pawn and I have a nice constructor. So this is one. One, let me see. Oof. It's a laggy day. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight plus that one. Okay, so this is all good. Okay, I don't see. Ah, here I thought I'd remove that. Didn't I? I thought I did. Um, So here I have already a very good position. Okay, a3. It's kind of normal. Here I will just play bishop. If I just want to exchange, play knight d7, knight d4, knight e5, knight c5, you see on dark square, I'm doing quite well. And I will do even better when I will exchange this, this knight, which can control the, the dark square, which is not the case of this light square bishop, which will never uh, control any light square. So knight f6 is a bit of a provocation, so let's go f4. Let's run into the provocation, rookie one here. It's uh, Rocco is thinking here for a long time. a6 is a very logical move. So Philosoph is still playing very fast, but let's see what he wants. So here, long castle, which makes a lot of sense. But I don't think it's good, actually. Uh, because now, takes, takes, you have a problem on f2. I will go b5, I'm not sure. I, I think it was better to take, take, and play f3, and then I couldn't go knight e3 because this knight would be trapped. So queen b6 here. Should I take and play knight c3? That looks very nice. And as well, they not all. OK, bishop d7 by Mbappe. So let me go h5. Uh, 
how do you see the board during the show? Because I do, did it in different way when I did it for the French community. Okay, so let's go here, here because this guy Mbappé, the tricky guy. I think he has to go 97. And then he has center, two bishops. I don't like my position, to be honest. Maybe ah 95, I'm quite happy to see. Um and also he doesn't have too many square. Ah knight f7 then, yeah. So maybe I can just take and play f4, but I'm not sure. Maybe bishop f4. Takes, 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 takes. Ah, maybe bishop f4 makes sense. Uh if takes, yeah. Okay, queen d4 from Donald Duck. But yeah, this kind of handling, I'm not supposed to be to be worried. And ID7 here. Okay, that is supposed to end up in some some kind of troubles. Because the queen is not placed very well here. Okay, Rookie one played by Rocco. This is interesting. Um, I cannot castle because of b5. This is quite annoying, actually. So maybe I should go queen somewhere to attack that guy. Maybe f6. f6. Okay, f6 is f6, yeah? I don't like to play f6, maybe queen f6. Oof, I should be careful with mouse slip here because... Uh, okay, queen, queen takes e7 was played, so I will just go a3. And I want to play b4, of course, you should play a5, knight bd2, and I don't think this queen is very well placed here, to be honest. So... Philosoph is playing b5 as expected. Maybe I will play c4 here just to ask him. Just to open up the game. Or b4 first and then c4. b4 looks like a, a very decent move, actually. a5, I'm just going knight bd2. And I still have. Uh, okay, bc6 was played. I have to play a bit faster against you, must lose to these bogs. And bishop f4 was played here, so I will go knight to d7. I will take whenever I want. One, two, three, with a bit. Uh, uh, so should I go b5? I can go b5 here. I'm not sure a3 is a good move because I can go b4, I'd be okay, one knight b1, and you have strange, very, very strange, very suspicious. So how many was that? Uh, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, plus that one. Okay, that's good. Just shout on the in the chat if I forget you. Just go and ah, I should actually have the computer and the chat, but I also have the games with the evaluation, so I should switch off the, <laughs> the evaluation. <laughs> okay. Uh, so bishop g3 is played. That's a very normal move. Now I will just castle. And I will try probably to play f5 at some point. Okay, here he's thinking, but his position is already quite bad, I think. Knight f7 played by Mbappe with, of course, very fast. He's running very fast. He's playing very fast. Everything is very fast with him. So f6, can I go knight h4 just to, okay, let's see, knight h4. That's a typical move, to just to annoy uh, y, uh, y, uh, black. I can go knight f5, bishop d5, I also some some idea, like bishop d5, king h8, queen h5, and knight g6 mate to follow. That's, of course, an optimistic scenario. So Mbappe, this is a very complex uh, middle game. I don't like my, my position, but I think he just misplayed it. I will play just knight h2. I just want to go to g4, and I hope he will push at some point, and I will, I will go to e5 with my knight. 
that would be a very just very very optimistic scenario for me but that's what i'm i'm willing to do so here is my my clock is not uh really great i think it's his move even if we don't see the clock running for him ah no now it works yeah i have some lag maybe it's because i'm sharing my screen on, on zoom i don't know it's never that laggy when i'm hosting the show but yeah i don't know it's it's a bit uh, uh it's a bit weird Opa. okay so i should go there again no i have a problem okay I have only ah yeah, yeah I should do that yeah, yeah. Okay, I will go to my games. Yeah, that's better. That's uh, ah, okay. So Queen Seven was played. Oh, very very tempting to go e five. Obviously, let's go. Just I win the tempo takes takes. Then I will have this nice square on d five for my knight, which could be a bingo. Here I will play knight g four. Uh, he took here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I should keep my bishop here. <laughs> and here I will just exchange knights. And I will pre move bishop takes e4. Castle here, b4. So it's my opponents to play. And here he played b3. Okay, so now if I go b4, obviously one knight a4. Did you see b5, knight c5? Okay, two. I think I just win a pawn. Which is not such a big deal, but you know, it's a pawn. Uh, so here we just play knight a4, eating the queen and winning some important tempi maybe. Uh, so c6 is uh, to be thinking. So h3 here, it's exactly what I wanted. So I guess it will take with, uh, I don't know, actually, probably with a bishop better but i can go knight d5 and i think i'm doing well so here it's uh, my opponents to play so i should go to the first okay okay fate is a clever move from our friend mbappe here i just take back and but still he's a bit uh he's a bit stuck maybe or maybe not maybe knight a4 b3 Typical plan to attack that pawn on B, B, A, B, C5, sorry. Okay, Donald Duck is playing F3, so in general, I can just go B8. Bishop C6, I will start to ask questions on about this B2 pawn. Uh, could be could be unpleasant question. So he's going Knight A3, which makes some sense. And I wanted to go F5. And I don't see any reasons not to. If takes, I take with the knight. I want to take the bishop on g3. And anyway, I have he has this knight, he has more space in the center due to this pawn e4. So I should uh it's nice to to exchange this f pawn against the e pawn for the pawn structure. So here, okay, f8, I think it doesn't matter. I will just go c4. And after takes, I will take with the I wanted to take the bishop, but now I'm a little bit afraid of d5. Ah, but I can go bishop d5. Because he's pinned. I was afraid of e d c d and now my queen is pinned, but I should remove that anyway. B c queen c4 is as well not, not too bad. D5, E D knight d5. No, I think I can take with the bishop just. And I will go to the other screen. So knight a4 was played, which makes a lot of sense, but. So here I will just play slowly. B3, bishop, b2, but I want some time. You see this queen is a bit weird. I will play bishop, b2, rook, c1. My moves are quite simple here. He took with the bishop as expected. If he takes my knight, I will take back here. He has to protect that guy as well. So if he, go queen, queen, if he goes queen, e2, I just go knight, d4. So that could be, that's already a, a problem, I think, for, for white here. Okay, queen a5, I just go b3, that was the plan. And 
Okay, 92 makes a lot of sense. Now I will go bishop c6. And I'm asking a question here, which is not a disaster, of course, for 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 white. Okay, g6 is a uh, very, very decent move. Just what can I say? Can I go f4? I want to go f4, but ah, touching your f pawn is generally too early. Um, but uh, I'm not a huge fan of my position, so I should do something, but uh, yeah, I'm not sure. And here again, rook b1 is a very logical move. I don't want to play d5, but because after ed, my pawns will remain weak. I want to play king h8 and f5. So again, I will do this uh, thing for the f pawn. So it took here. Ah, my pre move didn't work, which is annoying. Here, ah, because when I change the screen, maybe it didn't. It's just my pre moves are not there anymore. Ah, rook g8 from Mbappe. Okay, that's again a good move. I'll just go knight three. Now my new target is uh, the pawn c5. I will just go queen d2 next and ask him how he protects that one. Okay. Okay, so here it's my opponents to play. Knight c5 was played here. I just collecting one pawn here. Just bishop b2 after short castle. So knight g5 is in, is in the air. Putting mate on h7. I as well, the more position on rook ac1 or bishop e5 or knight e5. I have plenty of uh, options. So here bishop e5 came. Or just go knight e5. And he, it's a huge uh, issue for Nikki. I will just go rook c8 next after queen e2, rook c8. And I like my uh, the situations. Uh, I mean, the wall situation looks, uh, the wall picture looks quite good for me because my time is uh, kind of okay. I kind of like my positions almost everywhere. I will go bishop f4, just develop. I would say that one maybe is the more, That's maybe no, again, Zugzang 74 is, um, yeah, I'm not, uh, uh, let's say I would take black here. I'm not sure it's clear, but it's not my, I don't like it as white. Uh, so here I am just a clear, he has knight d3, so, uh, so I will play just rook a3. Maybe knight d3, but I would just go rook d8 and pin it, pin, pin his hook. So knight e4 is a, very logical move, so I will just go c1 and ask some questions here. About this pawn c6, if bishop d7, I just go knight e5 and yeah, I think I'm better. Uh, here, knight e5 didn't play, so let's go to the first here. So knight e3, it's often Mbappe to play here, bishop f4, queen b4, which I blundered, actually attacking this bishop and this pawn. Maybe I can castle simply and go knight d5 next. Probably I will have to do that, even if my, my plan was to go long castle. So queen b4 is a, a somewhat naive, naive move from uh, my friend Mbappe. Uh, what can you do? It's a bit naive. Can you hear my, my jingles? Can you hear that sound, Ayelan, or not? She's not listening. Can you hear in the Zoom? That's what the world champion has to say about this move. Could you hear it? Someone, please tell me. Don't let me alone. Okay, Bishop D7 played here. Okay, 92. Ooh. I just go f5. Could you hear? I can't see the chat. Wow. That's a bad day at the office for uh, 
Chest24. Maybe I should go to Twitch. I will go to Twitch. Let me go to Twitch. I will say hi to Twitch. Twitchy boys. So Bishop D7. Can I take, take, and I go F5? Okay, let me let me go. Chest 24. YouTube, maybe I should go. go on Twitch and say hi. Oof. Okay, Bishop D7. Yeah, I'm not sure about that move. Yeah, that's a good move, probably. I should prepare F5 somehow, maybe Queen F3 here. Okay, queen a5 played by Mbappe. But now I can go c4 and I want some important tempi in my, my opinion. Uh, okay, f bishop d3 makes sense. Uh, yeah, he's uh, playing a very, very decent game. Okay, knight c4 played by Rocco. It's been a while. That makes sense as well. Um, let's put a hook in the center. Ah, he wants a4. Okay. I see that. No, here. Yeah. Doesn't work as well. Could not hear. Ah, lightless. Ah, that's a pity. I have some sound with some uh, voices. It's very pity. Uh, but I was not sure that you, you could hear it. Okay, here, I, I pre-moved that. Um, it's Magnus saying one of the dumbest to move I've ever seen. So let's see for the threat is a4. He wants to tap my bishop, and if I go a5, then he just takes and my pawn structure is a disaster. So maybe I should just go rook d8. And after a4, I want d5. And oh, maybe I take first. Yeah, it's not a great position. Let's face it. Ah, knight takes b3. Wow. That was completely missed by me. Yeah, that's not. Uh... Let's face it. Um, it's a very bad news. So now I have to pretend uh, I have a Benko. <laughs> oh, I just lost a pawn. Yeah, I completely, uh, I completely uh, forgot that my my queen was protecting this pawn b3. So this is kind of uh, a bit embarrassing. Rook g5 played by Mbappe. Okay, now we go with queen d2. If takes, I just take back, and I pretend to be. Slightly better because of this pawn on c5, which is supposed to be weak. Okay, that's what they say in the book, at least. Here, I just want to go long castle, knight d5. I still have this lead in development, which could be quite a big deal. Okay, okay, d8, bishop c4. It's my opponent to play. Okay, here I played f3. Which makes sense after knight e5 wants f4. If knight f6, maybe knight f6 makes more sense. I want knight d7 and c5 and be sure what this pawn up. Ah, bishop d7 was played here, so we'll go just go knight e5, attack a bit here. Okay, queen e2. I will just go rook c8. Attacking on c4. If b3, I have b5 always. I think I'm, I just win a pawn already. I'm doing very well. So here it's my opponents to play. So here, ah, it's a pity my, my pre moves are not working here. d4, okay. So now I want to play knight f1. Why knight f1? Because I want to protect my pawn on g3 just to be able to play f4 
And this rook with protecting so far the pawn c5, but okay. That uh, could be a bit tricky. This pawn is weak uh, forever. So rook eight is played here. Ah. That's, um, can I go knight b5? I want to take a7, I want to take c7 and e6 check, which could be a, a very, very, very unpleasant surprise for my opponent, I believe. Bishop e8, I, attacking the pawn, I saw that I wanted rook e1. And if you take here, I just take here, take with the rook, then c5 is hanging. So, and if you play e5, I just go knight takes c5 and I'm, I think, doing quite well. King g7 played here, of course, now is a, is a pawn up. So why, why to hurry? Um, so now it's not clear to me what I should do. Probably rook b1 because uh, this knight is annoying, but here I should focus uh, more on that game, try to put some, at least some pressure on the clock. So here, queen b7. So here I will try to clarify the situation in the center, then D, I can go knight g5, queen b3, attack this pawn f7. If he takes with the knight, I take, if rook takes, then I have bishop d4. I'm doing very well. So anyhow, I think my position is, is quite good here. Knight f6 here. Okay, rook c8 makes some sense. Mm, lot of sense, I will go just go f3. And if knight f6, I will just go knight c5, and I pretend to be, to be better, which I think is a, uh, so after b3, just b5, and now I think it's uh, just a pawn. You cannot take because this knight on c3 is hanging. So I think I'm just uh, much better here. Okay, so thinking Donald Duck playing knight g5, which I missed. Okay. If I move my knight, then I will just uh, lose this pawn on h7. Maybe I'm playing a bit too fast, actually. Uh, so knight, queen d5 check might be a very good move from Rocco. Uh, let's see. You see, I'm putting a lot of pressure time-wise, but my positions are not that great. Then I will have knight e7, or let's say after a4. Takes, takes, maybe bishop e6 and d5. Yeah, okay. So let's pause here, maybe takes, takes, bishop e6. Can't go to g5 because f2 is hanging. So he has to find a square, which won't be great. So let's, let's go like this. g3 and let's go back. My game here, the time is... Uh, major issue, so I will go F4. It seems that Mbappe didn't see my idea because Bishop F7, now it doesn't protect. Yeah, he has to take a decision. If Rook F5, the Rook would be very uncomfortable on F5. Um, not lost. Maybe to F5, actually. Uh, let's see when he... So if 4 is a... What should I do here? I should go knight d2. Yeah, let's focus on, on that game because but not that pawn. Pawn b7, now he has to go knight c5. I think I will just come back knight e4 and if he goes knight b3, then I will go knight d2, knight c5, and then I will change my move. I don't want to do. Um, can take as well. Oh, that could be very bad news, actually. Knight c5, maybe okay, b2. Just want to take on b7, but yeah, I don't know. Okay, let's see. If he wants to take, I will just take back. Okay, play rook f5, which is a bit playing with fire, but I cannot see a way to punish it so far. But the good news is that he doesn't have any threats, so maybe knight h2, bishop h5, I have g4. If rook h5, I can go knight g4, maybe. 
Attacking f6. That could be a funny move. He has to play bishop g6, maybe. Um, then knight f2. Attacking everything. Oh, let's go for this. I like this move. That's a funny move. Of course, he will take it. I mean, come on. Mbappé, I know you. By heart now. Okay, takes. So that was promised. That is played. D now. I would just play queen b3, which looks like protecting here, attacking here. It's a very decent move. After rook 7 I can go knight g5. Or I can go for some uh, slow um, positional move. Which is not that easy to decide. So let's see here. Bishop e2 was played. I would just go bishop e6. And now I'm threatening rook a8. And careful. Could be made into... Oh, bishop d6. Nice intermezzo from... Uh, you must lose to these bogs. Ah, which I missed, actually. So, can I? Aha, uh -huh. if knight is seven. Let's see, that's beautiful. That's really well played. If I would take here, then it takes here. If, if I take on d7, bishop h2, king h1, knight g3, king h2, knight f1, king g1. Oh, maybe that's not too bad, actually. So knight d7, let's go again. Bishop h2, king h1. If I miss something, I'm just losing. But knight g3, king h2, knight f1, double check, king g1. If knight e3, I have queen c3, sitting mate. If he takes on d7, I take on f1, I have two pieces. Okay, I'm not sure, obviously, but I think it works. So let's go. Let's go for it. So a6 was played here. That is running into my tap, I think. King c7, I have, I have e6. So knight, ah, rook g8 he played, OK. That is a surprising move from Mbappé. Um, I didn't expect him to, to play. Um, such a clever move, actually. Uh, so g4, g4, knight c5 maybe is uh, the best now. You can go f5, it's a bit dangerous. Takes. But if rook f2, I have rook e2 all the time. Could be take, take, yeah. If rook e g1, then rook h5. Which way is a problem? I have to go g4 and knight c5. That could be relatively the best. I have to do that. Oof, if I lose to Mbappe in Simon, that I will never hit the I will never hear the end of it. So Zugzang is still thinking, which is a good news. Okay, fate, I can go knight g5 now. I don't see how. I think okay, fate was a bad move because now if knight b6, I just take on b6 and uh, yeah, so king b2 was played, and here I just go here. Okay, bishop h2. I have to do king h1. If knight g3, I just takes. And yeah, I'm really hoping for the best. Yeah, takes here. Yeah, I'm a pawn up for absolutely nothing. And can I play move king takes? Okay, rook b1, but that's. Yeah, that's already. Don't have even to check. I can just start exchanging. I will just take here. And knight f1, king g1, what was what I calculated. So, and I think it's, uh, it's working. So knight f1, king g1, knight e3, queen c3 is a major point, which I hope you will forget about because I'm trying to, to mate here. Queen h2, check. It's just, I will, I will go to that game because it's beautiful. Queen h2, king of one, and it's just a check. I have three pieces for a hook. I'm just absolutely winning here. 
Ah, rook h5 played. Here g4 was my point. But I'm not that sure. And I will just collect this pawn, c5. Okay, Zugzang played g5. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's quite a move. Uh, h6 here. Wow. That's a. That's just losing. Okay, 96. Can I go? I was counting on 95. Attacking that guy and that guy. Okay, now I have to think here for a while. Ah, so, so the obvious point is that if fg5, fg5, and attacking my queen and my knight. So this is a pretty, pretty, pretty big issue, which I cannot stop. Okay, I'm... Um... I'm actually, uh, G5 is a very nice move from Zugzang. I'm busted here. So I guess, what else can I do instead of uh, uh, trying to, to trick him simply? Takes, takes, if he takes on H4, Rook B7, but I think he has Knight A5, very strong intermezzo. So I'm just uh, here, doing very poorly. So here, takes, takes. Okay, rook d8, but I mean, in such situations, you have to take on c7. Good or bad, you have to do it because this you lose for sure. No way you get uh, out of this for some, some SG, our Polish friend with very long time and also have attack and uh fantastic position so f e i will just go 96 and i'm touching queen c4 98 as well this is basically game over here so here i took i take here was a blunder of my opponent i think donald the duck he has only nine minutes and he's just losing some some material i believe yeah, probably the lesser I is to take and take one of the pawns, but just exchange up. So that should be good for me. H5, H5 play, played by Mbappé, which is again a very good move. What's wrong with you, Mbappé, today? If I take, oh boy. So my position is very, very suspicious. So he wants to, if I take, 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 I'm just losing a piece. So I have to go g5, and if he takes, I just take. I don't have any other uh, options, to be honest. So, yeah, play the, the, the first move, and um, hope for the best, yeah? What can I do? Okay, okay, I will go to my games. Oof. Okay, so. Here is a play move. B5 played, but now it's open up the, the long. I don't even queen e4 to things queen c6, queen a8, mate in one or two. Ah, rook e5 was played here, as I told you. So queen d2. That should be a good deal for me. Okay, I'm happy to always happy to exchange queens. And now I should go a5. Okay, and here takes, takes. Okay, here I'm winning. Let's not forget about the second. Knight d3 was played, so I think I can just go c5. And okay, knight d3 was played, so that was, I was hoping for that. Queen c3, tapping the knight, tapping mate. Okay, so that's uh, king c1, I just go rook a1, if he takes, I just take back. And here, I'm just to clear pawn up. Oof, six minutes. Wow, against Nikki, I forgot about that board. So, I will just open up 
Because I'm just completely winning here, but uh, I have a small. Uh, ah, so he took Mbappe. Oh boy. That is not working. That is so. Quitter the page, yeah. I will just leave. I shouldn't do that. Um, okay, takes takes. Okay, and I should be careful about. Yeah, knight a five is a problem here. I'm just lost. I should go fast to the last game, which I uh, kind of uh, forgot. I will just take here and play e six. Yeah, d4, this is what I saw. Queen d4, and I wanted knight f6 at the end, which I he probably missed, actually. Um, still setting mate. Take, okay, why Nikki is not playing? Okay, knight f4 is played here, attacking that pawn, so I'm protecting it, and Nikki is not playing. Why not? That's weird. Okay, knight f5, and I probably have knight f6 here. Queen g4 as well is interesting. Queen d7, bishop g7, but no. This is the safest. Takes, takes, queen f6, and it's uh, you cannot prevent mate, so he has to go king h8. And I will remove my queen, let's say, to e4. 2e4 looks like a nice square, actually. Okay, that was played, and... Okay, he played e5, our friend Mbappe. And what does he want? I should just go g2. Rook g2 somehow free my... Uh... Yeah, no, I don't have to protect that knight. I can play rook e1, so this is freeing my rook on h1. So here the situation is kind of, uh, yeah, and here I have a major, major issue against Zugzang. Yeah, so maybe rook b6 I should go, or rook b4, why do I know, and start to, to play for chippos. What can I do? I'm just, uh, Okay, knight b8 was played with 30 seconds, but this is just game over. Takes, takes, I will just take the queen here. And that will be made in a, in a few moves. And some who, yeah, misplayed the opening and uh, yeah, then there were no way back. So let me go here, I will just take here. And that game will be just uh, gone. So knight c5. Okay, let me let me play the obvious rook d6. And I shouldn't oh eight minutes here, so this is not I'm completely winning, but yeah, I mean the time is not good. And uh, here I should do a bit faster. Ah 97, which I missed. Oh pa. maybe queen g5. Okay. King h8 is played, queen e4 is played. Okay. I should be careful about these two. Uh, so here, if I can finish the game, then that one, I have 12 minutes or eight? Okay, I'm now massively confused. 95, 95, bishop f2, I thought I had eight. Uh, 
Okay, six minutes here. Okay, rook d1 is a good move, attacking that pawn, attacking that pawn. Yeah, I can say, I mean, my... Yeah, that is not uh, really what I wanted, and I should... Rook g2, Mbappe is thinking, queen e6 resigned from Sam, SG, and thanks a lot uh, for the game. Thanks, can I... Um... Uh, I don't know how to uh, games. Uh, yeah, thanks a lot for the game. And here, no, that's the previous. Uh, so a5 here, my time is better. Uh, queen e4. Okay, so Mbappe is still thinking here. It's one. Zugzang just took. So I have to take and play queen h5 and bishop e4 and who knows? I'm lost, okay, but yeah. You don't win games by resigning, as they say. Bishop e4 is a clever move, but I want to to keep my bishop. I don't care about the bishop. I just want to enter on d2 with my rook. So Roko played rook f1, but that's start to get a bit passive. Of course, my first intention is to play knight g4. And this is my second intention as well. Knight e4 is played, but this is very, very risky. I can go queen c2 maybe. Go knight df6. Um, Oh, I can go bishop h6 as well, bishop h6, rook e4. Okay, let's try this. Why not? And yeah, okay, knight takes. I will just go pawn takes. Okay, a5 here, Nikki. It's is or her move is? I don't know. That's always what is confusing on the internet. You never know. Uh, if you sh should say he or she. Um, okay, let's go back here. Okay, Mbappe played bishop g6, but now my plan was to go rook e1. After e4, I can just take on e4. Okay, a4 is played, rook d2, he wants b4. So let me go, should I go a5? It's not, that's clear to me. No, don't think so, I'll just go rook d2, then I will go rook d8. Okay, now I just play here. And I'm sure there is some way to defend, but at least after takes, I can even go maybe bishop before threatening here. If takes and the rook comes and joins the, the, the action, that could be, I mean, like a practical game. Who knows? Could work. I could really win that game. I mean, that's not uh, impossible. Could go very fast, but objectively speaking, I'm the last. That's not even. Uh... So before I just go rook d8. Here, here, okay, here he took, I'm taking. He played knight d4, Rocco, but I will just go, ah. Ah, I see, that's clever. Didn't see that. Bishop c8, knight c4. If I take here, yeah, I have a problem here. So let me, I'm good on with the time, but here I should definitely, so what do you play? King h1, okay. That's kind of uh, a good news, I believe. So 
So let me protect that guy on D6. And here I took, oh, wow. Yeah, I just take here. I'm taking queen F6 and mate. So G3 played here. But um, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, should I go? I should manage to, to arrange my, my C4. So let's go knight F6. If he's going bishop F3, I will go C4, C3. And if F here, I've always knight D7, I'm doing well. Yeah, he's thinking, and let me see where I missed. I missed something. Uh, so he has this one. Oh, knight b3. Okay, let me exchange one pair, and I will collect on. I missed something against Rocco. Against our friend Rocco. I missed that after bishop c8, knight c4. If bishop d4, cd, knight f6, maybe that's the best. That's a lesser event and maybe some good scenario. I can put my, uh, okay. Okay, knight b7 by, ah. Ah, just want to take on d3. Wow. You gain a clever move by Mbappe. Hmm. Okay, I have no choice and to let it happen. Uh, yeah, takes, takes. Oh, the rook was, ah, okay. But that's not uh, a problem here. And I will just pre-move here. Okay, I didn't have to pre-move. Rook f5, giving me this check and bishop e4 with tempo. I will go for it. And bishop e4 next. Okay, fuse of played c5, but that's going to be to be bent now. Um, that's hopefully going to be made here. Yeah, I'm gonna just go knight f6, what I said. Okay, let's go g4. Oh, this takes takes. Ah, okay, you can just take take queen e6. Knight f6 only move rook g4. Yeah, that's that's good. So that's just good enough. Let's see how bishop f3 is played. Now I just go c4. That was the plan. I just want c3. Okay, queen f6 was played here, but that is going to be mate. You must lose to this bog. I didn't. Ah, why? Why? Sorry, why must lose to these bogs? Because it's good. Okay, so this is resigned from uh, why must lose to this box. Thanks for the game. That was a nice combination here, around here. That was kind of, I was proud of this because with bishop d6, I first, I thought, okay, uh, I forgot that move to be very honest. And I had to take here maybe, and uh, I can't move here. Yeah, takes, 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 but this is just fine for, for black. So that was a bit lucky and uh, uh, yeah. Thanks for the game, anyway. So this is king c1, I guess I have to go here. And uh, why is, um, I still have to go to the second fe, but this I was not afraid because knight d7, I will put my knight on e5. Okay, bishop g4, I'm not convinced. Let's put it that way. So I will go just queen e7, attack that knight, and one, one touch five. So yeah, I'm doing well. Yeah, I should just be careful about the clock. Not forget about the game, please remind me. Uh, so okay, king c1, here knight c5. But that's uh, just an easy, just a matter of king h8 was played. And my pre-move was not played. And here I'm just objectively not doing great at all. Okay, that is here as well. I'm not good with uh, my time is not really great, but it's uh, should be should be should be made. Yeah, 
Should be just my knight f6. Easy on the move for g4. That's just a massive bust. Let's see, maybe it will bug again. But um, I like to live a dangerous life. Life, sorry. King c7 is played. Maybe I should go rook e2 to go rook e6. If king d6, rook e5, so let's go rook e2. And if he's playing rook e3, I will take, take rook uh, and rook comes to e5. King e3 here. Here, I just give a check. Yeah. So here, uh, I will just go h4. And king is three. Can I go? Okay, let's go behind. Okay, okay. Rook f7 is played here. That's a good move. What can I say? So far, Zugzang is playing very, very well. Maybe all G6 to I know what is my threat, but yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that's hard to say here. Okay, knight C4, then I wanted to go B6 anyway. Then so Fan Roko. Okay, Mbappe is thinking. What about Nikki? What about Nikki? Play knight b5. Quite fast. Let's go h5. 455. She's getting. Um... Okay, one. Uh, one, two. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five. Six, se six, seven. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. So let's go. Rook c three played by Mbappe. Okay, then I was just planning to go here. Okay, bishop before is not really a problem. I just take here and I takes. Okay, then I will just go rook g1 and rook c1, bring the king, and that will be it. Okay, so king h7 was played. I will just go rook takes g5. This is just so over. Uh, h5, bishop f3 is the only move. Okay, knight e3, which is again a good move. Maybe I can go bishop b3. I want bishop c4. Knight d5, bishop c4, knight e3, bishop e6, knight f1, bishop f7. That's not good. Okay, so let's put my rook in some open line. Okay, Philosoph is at least doing a good job, not resigning. Um, King h4. Eight is absolutely the only move. Now I, I would like to find a, a quick, quick route to mate. Okay, bishop c4, that is a gain. Move I like. I mean, I don't like to see it, but uh, I think it's a good move. So let's go g6. And f4 played by uh, Nikki. I think this is a, a big mistake. Takes, takes, have queen h4 and takes with a pawn. Okay, so takes here. I will just take back. Okay, here I'm doing very well. Oh, so, okay, bishop f5 is played here against Zugzang. So, yeah, it's. I'm just. Uh, I'm just busted here. I mean, this is just. Uh, I don't know what to do. Uh, 
Mbappé, I will get back to you. Yeah, I, don't, I really don't know what to take sex G4 maybe. I'm so lost here. Okay. Uh, let's see if uh, some of our moves here it's played. It's a little pity, but yeah. I should at least uh, make sure that I win the other games. Uh, okay, here I just do that and we move H take. Here we get back to it, yeah. Okay, Bishop F5 is again a great move. Poof. Poof. Because the problem is that I take on f5, cook take f5, takes on h4, rook f8. Okay, I mean, just, uh, it's mate, yeah? Just getting mated. Okay, I have to take, what can I do? And uh, bluff it, yeah? Uh, can't do much. So let's go to uh, king f2, played by Donald. Let's go rook c1, and I will bring my, my king over. Okay, okay, eight. He's fighting well. If he lose off, but yeah, I'm just so winning. So e6, I wanted to go 95, obviously. Here. Takes, takes, okay. Yeah. So here I'm just I'm just cruising actually. Um he has 150 and okay. My knight is very strong, c3 will come, c5, b3 slowly, but. Oh boy. Sorry about the um, IT, some small problem. And when, you know, it's Sunday, Sunday, uh, <laughs> uh, people are uh, less reactive, which is kind of, of course, uh, very, very normal. Um, we, uh, no, I shouldn't, I shouldn't do that. Uh, yeah, so I shouldn't do that, obviously. Sorry. Um, games and yeah, let's see. So Mbappe played OK3. Okay, where is my clock ticking? <laughs> King H7 with Philosoph. Um, with Philosoph, then let me check you and let's see as well. Okay, bishop e2, I just go c3 or whatever. I don't know. I have time here. I don't have so much time. King h1, king f1 looks like panic to me. Just go g3. I'm winning. I should just be careful with uh, uh, bishop e2. Oh, okay, I don't know. I can just take it, really. Let's just push that. Yeah. Let's go back to the other one. And I still have this Mbappe decision to, to make. Ah, oh, okay, it was played here. So we just go hook here. Or should I go H3? I don't know what to do. Or maybe, yeah, hook here. Yeah, I'm just uh, Donald Duck. Okay, this is just a matter of simple technique here. I can just pin as well. Knight e4 was played here. I think just f3. Should do the trick. And let's see, Nikki is there. Okay, Gregor is fighting, but. 
not going to be enough. Oh, I still have this Mbappe decision. Okay, Mbappe, I want to take here and play hockey five. You got me. You want to play hockey eight, I know. Takes, takes, king c3, I want. And if bishop g6, so I can just go knight f3, king d6, knight h4, maybe. And ask you some. Uh, bishop e4, though. G6, King E7, G7. Ah, maybe it's not. You could have time there. Against Mbappe have 10 minutes, yeah. This is more than enough. Okay, Queen F6 is a good move. What can I do? I have to exchange. And yeah, I'm just uh, pissed down. End game. I will play just Rook B2. And uh, yeah. Um, I'm lost. I mean, this is just just a piece here. King of one. I would just go knight d4 because he doesn't have knight d5 and knight d2. I'm talking knight g3, maybe. Some cases. Ah, resign from Philosoph. Thanks, thanks a lot for the game. So I have only six games going on. Um, and here takes. I will just take. After d5, I just want to play hook e8. Okay, here I'm winning. King e3. Okay, so let me go here. Don't have weakness, but yeah, just just a full full exchange. So Zugzang, I'm just uh, completely busted. Ah, I forgot about that one, yeah. That's just insane what I'm doing. Yeah, I just forgot about it. Um, I can miss it. I mean, like take, take and hook the eight, hook the two, yeah? Maybe we'll do that, yeah. Okay, let's do that anyway. It's very short of time. So this is good. And our friend Mbappe, did you play? Rook F8. Wow, my knight. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, B6 played by Zugzong. Okay. Uh, so here we just exchange pair of pawns. Oof, oof, oof. I missed it completely. So can I go king c3 and rook e6, which is basically my only chance, but he will go bishop b1. I mean, this is just. It's very annoying. Okay, let me go here. Oh, wow. So let me go here. Knight b7, knight c5. Yeah. That's good. I mean, like, well played. Hoping for some miracle, but. Okay, so King G1, I can take here, but it's not winning. Let me see there. Oh. What about Nikki? Knight C7, that's a good move. Let's go D4. And here I just want to enter there. So I have three minutes here, so I should be. Should go fast. King b6 is a good move. Can I go before and try to mate? Before okay, f2, king c3. Ah. Hmm. 
Then A4 and OK6, but yeah. That's disgusting. I don't see it. I don't see the trick. Where's my trick? How is Mbappé have troubles in Simons? Oof, 95 is a good move. Yeah, not even taking. Yeah, that one is basically resignable. Um, and let's see the against uh, Bishop C4 check. Okay. No, I don't want to. Hook this three played. Okay. Good fight by Nikki. Let's go C8. I want to enter. Okay, bishop b3. Oh, that's a good move. Again, let me... Oh, I was about to blunder. Such a pity against Mbappe. I was under control. Against Zugzan, okay, he played well. I mean, like, not much to do. But here, I mean, okay. I mean, Insane, I mean, what I'm doing. So B4, OK, H2, A4. C5 first. G7, Bishop B1 is a huge. Okay, I do have to try something like that. Okay, here. I will just take here. Ah, I've... B8 maybe? No. Don't even have that. Yeah. King E3, King C4. The check. Let me go and see the here. I will just play knight f6 and brings brings the okay on b5. Maybe a check and back. Here queen b7, but now I just take here. Just collecting a piece actually against sneaky. That will be the end, I think. Because that's just a, a full piece, actually. I can even remove that. Or maybe I will have an even better move, so let's see. 226, though. I should be a bit careful. OK, he took there, and I go A4. And I'm pretending that. Uh, I'm going to mate, which is not even close. It's very disgusting. Ah, that's check. Ah, okay, good game. Ah, okay, my hook was hanging. Okay, I was completely out, so I'm resigning. That game, good game by Zhuk Zhang, 74. This G5 was very good. I completely missed, and then he didn't give me a chance. Well played. I just uh, forgot basically that of this pawn before I missed everything. Yeah, and then that G5 was always in the air. So yeah, missed a bit too many things. Good game. So that's one I lost. I won the rest so far. Here I will of course play for win with King G7. And here, ah, okay, resign from Nikki. Thanks, thanks a lot for the game. Bishop G8, bye. Uh, Greg? 
Gregor Samsa, who is fighting like a lion. It's not so easy now. Misplayed it. Okay, so I will open up this game and uh, yeah. Let me. So that's, uh, and then I will just go here. And I have the other one here. Yeah, okay. So that's good. Uh, C4, that one is over. That one is over. So I have only four games remaining. Uh, one is dead lost. This one is easily winning. This one against Roko. Okay, the clock is not good for him. So maybe I have knight d5 here. Yeah, if rook is c1, which I think is the idea, if rook takes e3, knight takes and knight takes c4, and I'm winning the pawn. Mm, okay, and I have to look at uh, Gregor. Yeah, but not because now bishop g8, king b3, and yeah, suddenly it became very unclear if I'm going to win or not. Hook d8, maybe. Ah, native three, okay, five is always a major issue. So, can I try to type the bishop? Let's say g6. Let's go g6. Let's try to confuse. Okay, I'll go play the hooky two. Okay, I will open four different windows and then I can just uh, see. Yeah. Uh, so Mbappé, I will just go here and another one. Sorry about that, but that's uh, when there is um, not so many games, it's what I like to, to do. And the last one is uh, against Donald Duck, who resigned. So there is only three games remaining. Please stop me if I'm wrong. But I think that's uh, okay. So here I have six minutes against Mbappe. He has 30 seconds here. But, and here King B3. I didn't forget anyone, yeah? Hope so. Yeah, okay. So only Gregor from here. Yeah, okay. So, hook c2. Yeah, I have to take, I think. Okay, I'm taking. And I will join with the king. Okay, king b3. And here my plan was to play hook d8 and to annoy him. Ah, but he has bishop d5. Okay, okay, I have to take here. That's not great. Okay, king f2, well played. I want king e6, maybe king d5, if I can. King e6, e4. Uh, what did Mbappe here? Yeah. Oh, it's so sad to lose to Mbappe. Hmm. Should I go king f5? I will go king e6, e4, king d7. Maybe d5 at some point, I don't know. Uh, let's see here, here, here. Yeah, of course, I'm not better anymore. I mean, like. Ah, yes, yeah, Voxy 4 even.
Yeah, okay, well played, Mbappé. Very lucky <laughs> from you, my friend Mbappé. That was just, yeah, to miss. But then, what should I do here? Maybe knight f3, but it's not. Yeah, I completely missed that idea that he can go k8. Okay, okay, I'm resigning here. So that's minus two. Um, so let's try to trick at least our friend Rocco here, King C3, and our friend Gregor Samsa. Yeah, I didn't play too well to, today. Thank you, Nikki. Thank you. I forgot. Uh, thanks a lot for the game. And I forgot about your our game at some point. And yeah, that's the problem in this clock simul that you forgot about one game and then I was in, in trouble uh, uh, clockwise. But I thought I was doing very, that's why also I forgot about that game. Uh, I think I, I was doing very well very early and then you, you created a lot of problems. So that was, that was really uh, tricky at some point. But thanks again for, for joining. Okay, so I will go here. And okay, here I'm marginally better because this pawn is a bit weak. But also this pawn is fast, so I don't know. Okay, Rook C1. Sorry, so he wants to go to F1, I guess. Or H1. Okay, I will just go F7. I don't want to. To let him enter there. I think I will just go who catch one h5, who catch four, king d5, to king c4, he has to play king d3, and I, uh, I have rook f2 maybe. Taking g2. This is my hope at least. What is it? This is it. Okay, who catch one, so I go h5. Okay, king b3, but can I go rook h3? If this point is lost, then it's two, two passers, two connected passers. It could be very unpleasant. So at least I'm... Uh, um, Doing well on the clock. So here I just take. And I will just go. I think King A4 is the most reasonable, yeah. And now let's push. I mean, I have to. I mean, this pawn is hanging. If he's taking H7 and G6, I mean, I've Rook and Knight against Rook. So what, what can what can I, I really do here? OK, Rook C1 is a bit passive, but probably more reasonable. Mm. So now I should make something happen here. Probably that. Who catch seven H four? Open up a bit here, and I think it's a draw, but I will try obviously. So here I should start calculating G four, but I think it doesn't work. If I could collect <laughs> the pawn here, that would be nice. Who C three king B five? And then g5 h4. That's probably what. Uh, yeah. What I have to do. Okay, for now. I'm over pressing here. Okay, let's push. I will play bishop d8. It's a bit risky. What can I say? If bishop c4 trying to push, I think I can take everything. King takes c4, king is seven, and the pawn ending, I'm in time to go to c8. So the pawn ending is just winning for black. That's a small trap. If he wants to play c6, then I think he has to play bishop d5, and I will go g4, c6. I will go h4. Okay, let me push that guy. I've always knighted knight a6 as um, if. If it goes wrong, you know, it's nice to have a, a backup 
backup plan. Okay, c6. That's a good move. Should I go g3? g3, bishop c4, g2. Yeah, g3, I think, is a good move. g3 and then h4. I should push on the same, but he, he really wants to play bishop c4 here and c7. So I should go g3, which prevents uh, bishop c4, I think. Okay, okay, for one, that's a good move. Again. For Morocco, I mean, I completely, uh, let me, let me play a small, small move here. Maybe I'll just seven. I just want to wedge four. Not sure about that though. Okay, King B6, he already wants C7, so now, how do I do it? If 96 is winning, could be. 96, bishop c6, rook c6, king c6, g2. So then queen, rook b1, only move. h4. Rook g1, h3, and then h2. And I have to show how to win queen against rook. Um, but probably I don't have anything better anyway. Huh? So let's go. Okay, h1 is a good move. Okay, I don't want to draw. You know me, Hoko. You know I don't want to draw. I hope I didn't miss anything. Yes, to go b1. Okay, four doesn't help. King g5. Okay, okay, fate, but. Okay, for king e5, it's more precise, and I just queen my pawn. So of course, after after the um, after the Simon, we have a, a talk with. Uh, I forgot to to mention that, but uh, you probably know that we have we are in the same Zoom call apparently, and uh, we have we have a. If you have any question, feel free to to ask. Uh, about the game or menu about the game, I guess. Uh, as you see, I'm playing like um, nine games at the same time, so it's uh, I'm sometimes uh, confused myself. I mean, like against Zugzang, I mean, like he just played uh, better games than me. I mean, it was it was excellent game. Here, I hope I don't get mated. Okay, King D3. I should be careful with my, my king. He has this A4 pawn, which is my only hope. Um, I want to play King E6, because if I go S3, takes, takes, and Rook F6, and my king, I don't like where my king is sitting. E4 is not a threat because it's spin, but I cannot move my... My hook. So let's go h4. After king d5, we we'll go h3. And rook g1, I may even go king f5, which is probably a better move to avoid this queen against rook. She's winning, of course, but takes more, more time. And you never know. Uh, so h3. And if he has to go rook g1, I think, and I will go king f5. So king e4. Okay, I'm not too unhappy to see that because takes, takes, and now this a4 pawn. We'll just go with my rook behind and try to collect it. But yeah, of course, it's a draw. I think I already played against Rocco, I'm not sure. Okay. <clears throat> Alors. Yeah, Ninimus and Remy Bay are talking to me in the French chat, which is not good. 
Uh, she's talking the English chat. I tell you, when I'm, I was showing English. Rook H1. Rook G7, Rook A1. Opa. He wants to get some play, so let me go here. I could have, I don't know, D5 at King D3. Just. Um, Rook yeah, this is winning, just uh, because I think he has to go G1, otherwise I will queen both pawns. And then I go King F5. That's just uh, very easy. Okay, Rook B2, I just queen. Of course, if I would have removed Rook H2, that would have been a brilliant move, but yeah, just to queen and... Uh, Okay, d5. So let's go here. Thank you for the game. I guess you resigned. Thank you, Gregor Samsa. That was okay. Let me let me have a look. Um... Ah, that was this coach where I think. Yeah, this is a bit. I think you should take here first takes and the f3. So, oh, bishop e2. Then my, I have to remove my knight and then long castle with check. Then you win. I think you win the tempo because here, here you have to lose some one, one tempo to to protect that pawn. You cannot go bishop e2, which is very natural or h3. So you have to first put the king on, uh, let the king on e1, and then after d2 before you already. I mean, if you go a3, then I go before what I said. A b okay one at b1. It's a bit tricky. If you go king b1, of course, bishop e6, I win a tempo a3. I even have some ideas like rook a7 and b4 next and rook a8. It's very tricky already. After b3, b4, it's a pawn. I mean, it's not a, of course, I have these stupid pawns, but I have some initiative and um, pawn up. And then, yeah, and then I misplayed it, but yeah, around here. Yeah, I was a bit surprised. Yeah, you should just give a check, I guess. Oh, just play rookie four, key three, and play it. Keep it safe. I think that's just the door. Uh, that's just the door. I'm what I said. I'm better. Like I'm on the better side of a door, but nothing really uh, dramatic. B7. Okay, so I want to check him. Oh, King F5. So let me go here. Yeah, of course, after Rook H4, he wants Rook G4. After Rook one he wants Rook G4, but I have Rook D1. I think on the one he might have missed. I'm attacking this. If e4, I just go d5, I'm collecting a4. If you go king e4, I just go rook a1, collecting that one. So I think the only move is king e6, correct? If I go rook a1, you go rook g4. I can go first of all rook b1, which probably he missed. But I can as well just go rook d3. Because rook b1, king d7, I was afraid. Rook b4, rook c8, and I have to stay on c4. This is my rook c4 back. Otherwise, I'm lost. I mean, I'm not, it's not lost, but it's perpetual with this one here. I think king d7, ah, king d7, I just take here. I think it, anyway, it should be. I mean, it should be a door in different ways, but you have to be precise as white. If you go rook g3 now, my, 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 my trick is to go rook a3, attacking that pawn, and you cannot protect both pawns, e3 and a4, unless you have the rook on e4, but this is not really possible. So if you go, that's very interesting now. If you go king d7, rook d5, rook c8, rook c5, and you just wait, king d8, king d7, it's not clear what I'm doing to improve my position. Actually, I don't see maybe d5, d4. I don't know. 
Thanks a lot, Gregor Samsa. Thanks a lot. That was a, that was a fighting game. Very interesting. Uh, yeah, as I, as I said, I was, I think, much, much better after the opening. And then um, you defined it well and I misplayed it, which is, uh, in general, the right combination to come back into a, a bad game. Many games that didn't start well. So now his thinking is under pre time pressure. I have 10 minutes extra. Yes, he's playing basically with his 30 seconds. It's good when he has a series, series of moves to, to make, but here now it's a decision to make, which pawn to give, in which conditions. I mean, for me, it's easy because uh, I have to find the best. I mean, this is my only chance in my my opinion. Yeah, here. So now what I want to understand, I think he has to go e4, d5, e5, d4, e6, I d5, and king takes c8. Oof. That is very nasty. King d8, now I want it d5. My big trap is king d7 on the move, now d4. Ed, rook d5, check. King e6, again. Yes, king e6, he's lucky. He has attacking my, ah, rook d6 and takes. Okay, this is over. If you go e4, I just go d3. I think he's not in time to, he's definitely not in time. He has to play rook d8, probably. Um, but yeah, should be winning. Uh, how? I, the Alp. So I think the only way for him to play a few more moves is e4. He's pushing his pawn. I'm pushing mine. And now he has to play rook d8. And now. Okay, that one I didn't see. That one I didn't see at all. Ah, I can just go rook d5 check now. I think it was winning anyway. If king e7, I can push, and king e6 I have this rook d6 check, very important. And now I'm just pushing, and I'm just queening, and this is just over. I think I can even pre move safely. D2. Thank you, Rocco. That was a um, it's very interesting game. The ending was obviously drawn, but it was a well played from you, I think, and uh, very interesting. So it's G. Sorry, sorry, G. The in French is the. Okay. <laughs> Should I, I can't see them or? Okay. Oof. You should put your, your mic on. No, we can still, you have a small mic. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hi Laurent, thanks for the game. It's Duke's one. Ah, and congratulations! Very good game. Yeah, it was I was scary as hell during during the game. I, I took your piece on h4 and I thought it was over. But you played on and then the attack came and I thought, oh my god, what's happening here? But you played, yeah, yeah. But you played the very. I mean, you played a nice uh, couple of defensive moves and then I couldn't see what to do. So yeah, that was uh, really. You just punished my mistakes uh, very effectively. But, um, thank, thank you for the game. It was like, wasn't very, 
very special experience. Um, as a, yeah, as, get, as a scary player like me, it was something special winning this game and holding the defense together. Yeah, I yeah, know that was that was a good. And my opening was not great, and then I blundered this pawn b3, and uh, yeah, that was not. Um, I was trying to find some counter chances, but yeah, uh, you didn't let me. So yeah, but not, not much. To be honest, after your b3, I was already out of the book. I had no idea. I had never played this structure with d4 before. Ah, okay. Well, you played uh, very well, I think. I think okay. you played a very model game. I mean, it's just if I don't give the pawn on b3, then maybe I can I can show. Um, I think it's just a complex middle game. I mean, like nothing really. Um, yeah, I think it's just. I mean, I like black. It's what I said during the show. I don't know if you are listening yeah. or not. I heard it. Uh, you gave me the hint with knight h5. Ah, okay. Knight a5 after taking. So sorry for that. <laughs> okay, it's no problem. <laughs> That's also the part of. Uh, yeah, if you if you are listening, you are disturbed. But uh, in a way, yeah. sometimes you have a move. So uh, f4. Uh, yeah, no, I think it's just a complex middle game. Of course, queen f3 is just a blunder because you just take the pawn and yeah. uh, I can basically. But I don't know what really. Maybe, I mean, it's very, very difficult for me. I'm not used to this kind of position. So maybe I should take on e5, actually. I don't know. Maybe I yeah. should take here. I guess you want to take with the pawn. Perhaps of the knight? I don't know. With the knight, maybe. Yeah, you have a nice knight. The is already quite weak. Yeah, I can take on c5 then. Yeah. I think we cannot move the pieces, unfortunately. You do, do you know? I yeah, I have to take with the pawn, yeah. If I can analyze the game. Because here I cannot move the pieces, which is yeah. uh, a bit of um, a shame. Okay. Uh, no. But takes, knight takes, I guess I have to takes on c5 queen c5 bishop d5 and knight f3 but i mean i agree i mean i think i, I generally play uh, uh in my career i had more um more, more, i mean i played more times this this uh, system as black than as white so i mean yeah. basically i like this as black i mean uh, it's not something i'm doing in uh, in classical games or uh it's just uh, simon yeah. i wanted to try something so uh, yeah, I, so I don't like it as white. I take it as a model game for black from a future play, I think. Yeah, I think from it's the a game, space, yeah. right? So thanks a lot. Um, I don't uh, want you. to take all the time from the other participants. So Thank you very much and congratulations again. Thank you. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Well, so someone else wants to ask or just say something? I know that Loren has uh, another activity soon, so... Uh, Gregor is sure. there. <laughs> I see. Oh, Ralph. Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> yeah, if Laurent can say a few words about the game, I would be very interested. Uh, just let me know your nickname. Rocco. Ah, OK. OK. Uh, I thought you were French, actually. Je vis en France, donc. Ah, OK, OK, OK. <laughs> Maybe for the, for the show, we speak English. Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, your, your accent um, was not very French. But uh, yeah, no, that was a good game. I was a bit, uh, uh, yeah, I think it was a complex. I would say it was very quite well played. Um, yeah, you had quite an attack at the moment, but then in the end, it became oppositional. Yeah, I think here yeah, actually I'm better because uh, I think after f5, I start to like black position because I want to play f5, f4. You, you have to take here, takes here, and you see this pawn on f2, I think is weak. I will take your your, your bishop on g3. So I think I think black should be better. But that was always a tempo short to get rid of the bishop b6. Yeah, exactly. And uh, then here, you trick me. Uh, because I saw knight g4 was very good, but actually I completely missed knight d4. So here I should be better somehow. I don't know how, but uh, maybe bishop g4, just to keep the bishops. Something like that should be a bit better for black, is my guess. But then became 
just some kind of very qualish end game. And what I said during the, of course, I was trying to play. I think you did well till, till, um, till basically uh, the end. I mean, like here. Yeah. It's uh, just I have no time anymore. So I yeah, <laughs> I was playing on, on time. Yeah, that's for sure. So here in king d3, king e6, king e4 is okay. Here the most simple is just d5 check. King d3, and what can I do? Yeah, I, much. I became over aggressive. <laughs> yeah, you wanted to win here, maybe. Oh, uh, I don't know what you. But here, I mean, like any move, basically. I put the rook on e4, and everything's safe. Yeah, I mean the pawn d5 is a bit. I I don't. Yeah. I think d5 and king d3 was just the easiest. Mm. D5, king d3, rook to d4, and okay, for let's let's make a door. But here. Yeah, it's already tricky. So I thought um, here you can still play, I think, rook g4, which was the best. Rook g4 and the same plan. Just you go to d4 with the rook, and uh, that's great. But here, king f5, yeah, is um, you probably missed. Uh, I think e4 here was a safe door. Like, no, not here. No, here it's a bit tricky, actually. Yeah, it's a bit tricky. Here was my plan. I thought you would play e4, and I wanted d5. Hmm. And if you go e5, I go d4. And if you go e6, I have rook d5 check and king takes e8. So that was my, my plan. But I think here you don't have a fortress. Actually, at the start, I thought it was a fortress. But I have this plan, which I, we, yeah, which I, I shot you. Fortress too, and then yeah, I saw your check and <laughs> lose yeah, my... Yeah, this is just uh, basically over, yeah. d4, oh. and um, yeah, this is just over. Uh, so yeah, when you lose... If you lose one of the pawns, you should lose the e4 pawn. But how to do it? I mean, here I was ba basically relaxed because I knew, I mean, what can I do? I have to create some chances. And uh, well, you have to find the solutions. I mean, I don't really care about uh, <laughs> which solution you will you will come up with because my, my moves are quite fast. I don't have many options here. So, uh, but here maybe. Maybe you have some defense. Probably you have some defense. But maybe you can play here rook g3. Protecting here, I have to play rook a3. You go rook g4. But no, I take with check. No, it's not. Maybe you know even that is a door. It's pity I cannot move the pieces. But um, let's say rook. You go rook g3, rook a3. Or you go rook g4, let's say. You, I go rook e3, king, d, king d7. I'm not even sure that this is a winning for me because how do I activate my king is very unclear to me. And with the rook, you are threatening rook d4 and you protect everything. I, I don't know what is my next move to, to bring uh, the king over. So that's a um, yeah. interesting end game, but just not enough time to. <laughs> yeah, no, for sure. Yeah, no, that yeah, was uh, my, 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 my luck in that game. Thank ah, merci beaucoup. Merci. <laughs> merci, à bientôt. Okay, thank you so much, actually, for all the explanation here. Uh, okay, maybe last question there. Someone wants to say something? To uh, I have a question. Yeah, sure. Well, uh, in the history of chess, you have all these great players up to now who play under the French flag, even yeah. though they're French, Aljekin, Tartakauer, Spassky, maybe, I think, Ali, Ali Ruzer now. Uh, what what are you who, what who, are the, who, who? who now? Ah, Fiorja, you mean? Fiorja. Ah, so what sure. are kind of uh, how do the uh, French grandmasters? You know, what do you think of kind of your history and your present of uh, all these great players playing under your flag? Well, I'm not I'm I'm not an historian. I mean, to be to be honest, I studied all these games from uh, Alekine, uh some uh, oldest one like from Philidor, but much less, of <laughs> course. Uh, and uh, yeah, I mean, Philidor invented like the two positions in uh, in end games, for instance, so it's very famous. And La uh, yeah, La Bourdonnais, and also uh, Deschapelles. Yes. So in Deschapel. the 18th century, the French dominated. Yeah, that, that's then... th those days are over. <laughs> 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 and uh, yeah, I think it's, I mean, it was great for me, let's say, for to have Spassky had a direct um, impact on me because I had a training session with him. 
So oh, when I was okay. young, so that was just great. I mean, it was Pasquier living in Paris and yeah. being available, even if he was already uh, like uh, around 70 years old. I mean, uh, it's just great just to move the pieces, to discuss about chess with uh, a former world champion. I, 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 I was really, um, I was really very lucky and I, I was aware about that luck that you can, you about can talk. About how old were you? About how I was old 20. Okay. So I was very young and I was just asking questions and we were moving pieces. So that was like, we did it like two, three times, 10 days. So, you know, oh, wow. it's not That's great. It's, uh, something. Okay. After three, four hours uh, a day, he was getting a bit tired, but that was... Uh, was it very friendly? It was, he, he was incredibly friendly. It was, he was really, really friendly. And he yeah. was uh, really, really talking like, I think, with uh, giving some uh, real advice. And uh, so that was very interesting. And also to play, I mean, like to have Fioja is great because it gives like uh, uh, new interest for chess in France. Also this, uh, uh, for French players, if we didn't have this, uh, uh, this um, players from Soviet Union, coming in like Dorfman, Weiser, Andrei Sokolov. I mean, I played with them like a few times a year when I was developing. So it was, I was really developing as a player uh, those days. And that was thanks to, to the people who came in actually, because uh, the, the people who were born in France were like, let's say weaker. So that was uh, great for, I think it's not, uh, if MVL now is the number five in the world, uh, it's clear that uh, all these people who came to France, it's thanks to them as well, not only the talent of NVL. Thank you. You're very welcome. So maybe Gregor and we, Gregor is still here if he wants to say something. Or... Ah, no, we cannot hear you. Okay, bye. How is it working? Uh, now it's working, yeah. Okay, now I just want to say thank you for the game. It was pretty interesting. Thank you very much. Yeah. You outplayed me from the opening, so opening, so I just tried it to hang on. Yeah. Yeah, and exactly. End, exactly, I... exactly. It was what I was saying during the commentaries. I mean, like... Yeah, I didn't have did... time to analyze and I, 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 I don't listen to... To the comments yeah. during the game, so I, I have. I uh, think uh, around here, I mean, you are doing. I think it's just. Uh, I'm. It's what I said during the show. I mean, I'm on the better side of a draw, but if you play yeah. rookie four, rookie three, you protect that pawn. I don't think my my winning chances are are, are big. So, yeah, I misplayed yeah. it. I mean, like in the opening, I'm just. Uh, I think I pawn up and uh, the attack and. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's great, but yeah, you you hang in there and uh, you created some problems. Yeah. I didn't deal yeah. <laughs> uh, well with them, and that's uh, how the game. Uh, uh, that's, 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 that's how you make a draw, but you you didn't because you just at the end you had little time, yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I had one minute, so it was it was quite tough, yeah. Yeah, but thanks a lot anyway. It thanks was a lot. pretty interesting. Yeah. Thanks, thanks, thanks everyone. Thank you. Thank you. That's it for today. Um, Thank you. See you. Thank you. See you. Bye bye. Thank you.